New Century. It's four one-act plays by Paul Rudnick that are all about acceptance. There, there are four different scenes in the show. Uh, three primarily monologues, and the fourth one, everybody comes together. The first monologue is about Helene, who is a who is a Jewish matron who has a very um, interesting family. Well, she's dealing with her three children. They're all living in her mind what would be very alternative lifestyles. And there's a progression from her daughter who comes out to her as a lesbian. And then she has two more children and things keep getting more stressful for her to cope with each child. Second monologue is about Mr. Charles who is currently in Palm Beach. Um, he used to be in New York for a while, but he lives in Palm Beach now because basically he is just too gay. Um, with all those social mores right now. The third monologue is about a mother from Illinois who is all about um, crafts, and she's got a gay son who has died of AIDS. And it's, it's probably one of the more sentimental monologues. The other ones are, are, are hysterically funny. This one's a little more sentimental. The last scene is all those three principal characters, plus a couple of ancillary characters come together in a nursery in New York by a freak accident or whatever. It's just hysterically funny, and it's all about accepting who you are, accepting your family, accepting your place in the world, and just being the new century. It's all about what's happening in the world right now. It's very funny. It's a serial comedy, but it's mostly a comedy. There's a lot of stereotypes, but it's fun. It's, you know, come out and support the Richmond Trials. They can expect that they're going to have a really fun time laughing like crazy. That's what they can expect out of this show.